Hi there YouTube, this is uh, AC Dodd and I thought I would do an unboxing of something new which I bought this year to uh, facilitate my mobile tuning. Um, as some of you might know, I use obviously powered equipment when I'm out and about tuning, especially when I'm in the field. Uh, generators can be inefficient, so I've looked at what's available and I bought myself a portable power station. Um, and this particular one is the EcoFlow Delta Mini. Um, I'm not going to get into its specifications right now because I'll do another video on that uh, after I've used it. So you can actually, uh, so I can actually tell you whether it's any good or not. Uh, suffice to say, I bought this so I can actually uh, use all my equipment. I can charge it in the vehicle. I can even run it off solar panels if I need to. Um, I haven't got the solar panels now; they'll come later. Um, but I can also run my portable compressor off it as well. So it's quite a powerful, powerful little beast. Anyway, without further ado. I'll take my knife and let's start unboxing. Be very careful when you're using your knife, obviously you don't want to split anything inside. It's very nicely packed. As you can see, nice clean box inside. Nice packaging, Let's lift that out. And inside the box, we have the unit itself, and then we have another box, which I'm assuming is gonna be for the cables, etc., that come with it. So let's just have a quick look in there. Very nicely presented. Nice and tidily wrapped up, so we've got oh, we have a mains charging cable. Um, looks like we've got a sort of DC to DC uh, connector. There is the solar connector with the MC4s on the end, and the end, I believe that's an Anderson connector. Um, to uh, put the power into the unit um, and there is also uh, another Anderson connector but this one is to use the um, cigarette lighter in the car. Put that to one side, put all the cables to one side. Uh, also in the box it comes with uh, quite a large user manual which is very nice. Um, and instructions for solar panels connections. So that's something to read later. And then in the box, the unit itself. There we go. Just put that on the table. And move the box out of the way. And we can uh, start unpacking the unit. Uh, it's, it's very nicely wrapped up actually. Sealed at both ends. So let's uh, break the seal, so to speak. Open the bag and see what we've got. There's some uh, Bit of advertising on the top, which is just a I think that's just a peel off yet. I don't think we need that. There we go. Ah, it's a nice looking unit. It's quite, it's quite, it's weighty but easy to carry. And one of the reasons why I bought this unit is because. I'm used to taking a uh, 23 kilo battery when I do my mobile tuning, which to be fair, uh, as I'm getting older, is starting to get hard work. So uh, this being 11 kilos is much easier. And actually, I can even carry it one-handed. So uh, that's quite a sensible uh, weight saving. So I'm very happy with that. Basically, this gives me a lot more options um, in terms of powering stuff for a lot less weight. And that's the benefit of going from lead acid to uh, lithium ion technology. Okay, so uh, I'll give you a quick once over, just uh, see if we can turn the unit on. 
there we go if you look at the screen it comes uh, with the internal battery at 30 percent which is obviously expected for uh, transporting etc and storage um, the screen's nice and simple uh, just tells you the level of the charge of the battery inside and it gives you the input uh, wattage uh, anything your you know solar panels or your charge rate and then obviously the load of the output you've got a various arrangement of usbs on the front and then on the rear of the unit you've got two uk sockets on the top there you've got your um, solar or dc input you've got a selector for slow or custom uh, charging you've got the uh, mains input there you've got a regulated car 12 volt adapter lighter socket there as i say that i think is going to suit me down to the ground i'm not going to do any more on this right now what i'm going to do is put it to work so a lot of people uh buy these or have them sent to them free of charge i've purchased this with my own money so i intend to actually use it for purposes of uh, um, facilitating my work um, a lot of people use these for camping and recreational use. Uh, this one's actually going to earn some money. So um, the good news about that is I'm going to use it and probably use it quite hard in certain circumstances. So I'll do a review uh, later in the year and then uh, we can see uh, if it performs or not and how well I like it. Anyway, thanks for watching this video. And uh, as ever, like and subscribe if you want to find out more. Thank you very much.